Welcome back to another PCC Short. I'm Jonah Johnson. So all of my fields, crops, staining left the field have turned black. What happened? So that's been the question of the week thus far. So um, if you think about it, much as in the field behind me, this black color that our crops have transitioned to is actually from a beneficial fungus called saprophytic fungus. This fungus helps break down dead plant material and is out every single year, just some years is worse than others. You may recognize this when you harvest the remaining of your crop, the machines will turn black, the dust coming out will be very dark. This is an inhalation hazard, so be aware that try not to inhale that when you're about this equipment through the dust, especially handling the grain. So this fungus is out here, like I said, every single year. This year, hence, it just got uh, more in population because if you think about our plants being out here for an extended period of time, whether in the drought prematurely killed them or they've been out here waiting harvest through the very droughty summer, it's been very hard on the crop. This fungus is, uh, takes advantage of those type of conditions and the only limiting factor it was was missing is water. So from Hurricane Helene moving in, brought a lot of rain events and high humidities. This made this fungal pathogen essentially explode and become uh, very aggressive and basically change color overnight almost as it seems. So again, nothing we can do about it, but, um, but just letting you know what, what that is and why everything turned black so quick. Another side effect of the recent hurricane is that a lot of the very dry grain, mostly soybeans especially, those pods have shrinking and swollen and opened up, allowing water to enter, which has in turn made a lot of the seeds with the potential to germinate. When you have exceptionally dry grains down to eight, nine percent moisture, it's essentially gonna be very uh, sensitive to any water moisture increases and with these rain events soaking through the wind blowing rain, they're starting to germinate in some locations. So be on the look for that. That can deduct grain quality and what the end user wants them in the future or what to do with those beans, especially in regards to storing on farm. Just be very cognizant. If you have more questions, as always, follow us on pctnutrients.com. I'm Jonah Johnson. Thanks for watching.